As we told you earlier, 19-year-old Jordan McNair was remembered by hundreds of mourners today. The University of Maryland football player collapsed during a practice and died two weeks later. Alistair Meechett reports from New Psalmist Baptist Church where family and friends said goodbye. The service at the New Psalmist Baptist Church celebrated a life cut short even as an investigation into the death of Jordan McNair is just beginning. It took a number of buses to bring teammates, coaches, staff, and friends from College Park to Baltimore. Hundreds from the University of Maryland joined the family members of Jordan McNair. His roommate was among those who spoke. Jordan is someone that no one will ever forget. He's one of the best friends, sons, cousin, roommate, and teammate that anyone could ever ask for. The funeral program captured that link to the university. The 19-year-old was starting his second year at College Park. May 29th, while practicing with the football team, Jordan collapsed. He was rushed to shock trauma for a liver transplant and died two weeks later. Cause of death has not been revealed. The university's response... The prudent thing to do and the right thing to do uh, when a situation like this arises is to do a review. An outside sports medicine and training consultant is being brought in. According to the university, the review will evaluate relevant policies and protocols as the safety and well-being of our student athletes is the highest priority. Many of whom attended Jordan's service, which celebrated his life and accomplishments, even as his parents endured one of life's toughest ordeals. But at the end of the day, we're grateful for the 19 years that we had. And obviously, by the look of the room, obviously, we did our job. I thank everyone for the support. That independent investigation authorized by the University of Maryland is expected to take 90 days to complete. Back to you on TV Hill. Jordan Manair was courted by a number of colleges after graduating from the McDonough School. He chose Maryland because he says he wanted to stay close to his family.